everybody. I just want to encourage you today. It is a time where you have been promoted. You've come through the beginning of August and now you are being set up to rebuild. Yes, now is a rebuilding time. According to the Hebrew calendar, we're getting ready to come up on the month of Elul. It is the time uh, in the book of Haggai where Haggai spoke to Zerubbabel and said, now is the time to start building the second temple. We, The Lord needs a house where he can reside. And so I I just want to encourage you that as you've been promoted, God now wants to rebuild a very strong structure. And he wants to start with your soul, with your mind, your will, and your emotions. He wants to begin to build you up strong in your strength and in your faith, the faith of the Lord and in the glory of God. This is also in the month of Elul where we remember Exodus 33, where Moses ascended the mountain. And it's there that he asked the Lord to show him his glory. And so the glory of the Lord and also the strength and power and might of the Lord are going to build your house strong. You've been promoted now. You need to know how to carry heavy weights of faith to step in to the new year 5781, which happens on September 18th at sundown. Yes, that's 5,781 days since the creation of Adam and Eve. And so God is getting you set up for this. This is a rebuilding time. Get into a place of prayer and say, Lord, show me your glory and show me how to build this temple, how to build my home home life, how to build my neighborhood, how to build my church, how to build everything, Father, that your hand touches. I want a house that can hold the glory of the Lord. And so I just want to encourage you today. God is with you. I see creative ideas, creative thoughts coming into your mind in which you're going to be able to write down how God wants to rebuild your house for this new year coming up. He wants to strengthen you. He wants to position you because he intends to put heavy things on top and it's going to require heavy faith. And so you need to have this house ready to go and rebuilt so that you are able to sustain throughout the year. And so I just want to say a prayer for you right now. Uh, you can go to also to Haggai chapter one to read that because that is a great place to start understanding the heart of God for how important it is to have a house where the glory of the Lord resides. You want to position yourself for purity, for holiness, living in the mercy and compassion of God during this time. So Father, I thank you for my friend who is watching right now. Lord, and I thank you, Father, that we're going to speak life to them right now and strength to their bones, strength to their soul right now. By the word of God, may every part of your body be strengthened. May you begin to start building a house that will able to host the glory of the Lord, that God is taking you to great places and you need to step into them. I thank you, Father, for creative miracles, creative thoughts, creative ideas, visions, dreams. Let the windows of heaven open in the minds and hearts of your people, Father, so they will begin to see the plan and can start building with you, Father. I thank you that Moses, in the glory of the Lord, began to carry forth your word into the Ten Commandments and brought them down to the earth for us to know and understand your justice, your desires, who you are God and I thank you Lord as you are rebuilding our houses getting us ready for the new year we are learning more about you so father I thank you that my friend is going to encounter the glory they're going to encounter greater relationship with you they're going to encounter heavenly uh, encounters God encounters is supernatural having their eyes their spiritual eyes and ears open their senses awaken to spiritual things so that this rebuilding phase can happen. I want you to hashtag rebuilding phase in the thread. Hashtag rebuilding phase. Yes, you are in a phase of rebuilding right now. Share this with a friend who needs encouragement. Maybe their life looks really rough right now. A lot of spiritual warfare. Whenever you're promoted, there's warfare on the front and warfare on the back. And that's happening to you. It doesn't negate the fact that God is rebuilding and he's setting things up for a strong foundation of faith where he can continue to put heavier weights upon you. Great things are coming. All right. Hashtag below rebuilding phase and share this with a friend.